Okay, now there is a question. You just tell me what are these errors. Okay, the first question. Okay, a Chang paid a, a Chang. Okay, sorry. Okay, you just tell me the answer. Okay. A Chang paid us fifty dollars by check. Who paid? A Chang. A Chang. How much he paid? Fifty. Fifty dollars. The transaction was entered correctly in the cash book. Mm. Okay. So what should be the double entry? A Chang paid us. He is our customer. So he paid us how much? Fifty dollars. In check. The transaction was entered correctly in the cash book. Yeah, so you will you will debit the bank column. You are receiving oh, cash a cash book. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So what is the double entry? What should have been the double entry? You debit the bank account yeah. and you credit a Chang's account. Okay. But it was entered by mistake in the account uh, in the account of a Chang. What 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 is the type of error? Com commission. Errors of commission. commission. Okay, so this particular error is known as errors of commission. commission. So how do you correct this entry? So you have a chain. Mm. There is an outstanding balance. Balance. Let's say balance brought forward fifty dollars. Now he paid. Yeah. So the bank account, no? Mm. When you receive, you will debit the bank account. A Chang. And you should credit A Chang's account. Mm. So instead of crediting, what you have done? The account as A Chang. Chang's account. Okay. Bank. Fifty. Okay. So instead of crediting a Chang, the accountant has credited a Chang account. Okay. So which entry is correct? So instead of crediting Chang account, you credited Chang account. Okay. So what is the correct entry here? What is the correct entry here? Bank account is. Correct. Yeah. You debited correctly. The yeah. bank account is credit debited correctly. Yeah. Whereas the credit entry is wrong. wrong. So how do you rectify this? To rectify this 50, what you should do? You should debit a Chang account mm. and a Chang account should be credited. credited. So you can say a Chang. This is a chan. Mm, okay. So thereby you can rectify this error. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. So what the accountant has done? The uh, customer has uh, customer a chan paid fifty dollars. Mm. There was an outstanding balance. Okay. But the accountant what he did? He debited the bank account correctly, whereas he credited a chan's account. As a result of that, this balance is still outstanding. Yeah. Okay. So this entry is incorrect. Mm. To correct this entry, what you should do? You have to reverse it. Mm. So you debit this entry and you credit, credit this account. Just tell me the uh, error. Mm. Okay. A motor car is purchased for thirty-five thousand five hundred uh, dollars by check. It is debited in error to a motor expenses account. In the cash book, it is shown correctly. So, what is the type of error? Principal error. Errors of principal. Mm. Okay. So, how you will rectify this? What is the transaction? Uh, you purchased a motor vehicle, no? So the motor vehicle you purchased and the amount was correctly credited. Mm. 
to the bank account 35,500 whereas it was not debited to the motor vehicle account instead where it has been recorded repair yeah repairs account motor vehicle repairs account okay 35,500 so how you will rectify this so this is the motor vehicle repair account you this is the bank account so how you will rectify this you credit repairs and you debit motor vehicle. yes so you credit this account and debit motor vehicle account this is how you rectify the errors okay so these kind of errors are known as errors of principle okay now next one so next question tell me the type of error okay revenue of 150 dollars is entered as both a debit and credit of $130. So what is the type of error? Original entry. Yeah, errors of original entry. You understand? Mm -hmm. So so how do you rectify this? The original amount is how much? 150. Mm -hmm. The revenue credit and debit your debtor. Okay? Mm -hmm. Instead of recording 150, 150 you recorded as 130, 130. Mm -hmm. So how do you rectify? Adding another 20. Yeah, exactly. You credit uh, revenue 20 mm -hmm. and debit your data 20. 20. Next one. The purchase of goods from K Oak for $2,500 is completely omitted from the books. Oh, then it's a omission. Errors of omission. Errors of omission. So how do you record this? Purchases of goods from K Oak. So how do you rectify this? Just record the transaction. transaction. So purchases debit and credit your supplier. Yeah. Okay. Next one. A businesses books contain two incorrect totals two incorrect totals purchases of $7,900 and revenue of $9,900 the purchases day book adds up to $100 too much in the same period the sales day book also adds up to $100 too much Compensation. Yeah. yeah so what has happened here so the purchases day book is over by $100 in the same time, your sales day book, the revenue account, also more by hundred dollars. Mm. So therefore, it's compensating. So errors of compensating. Yeah. Okay, compensating errors. Next one. So that you know how to uh, rectify. Yeah. Okay. Next one. Uh, a check for two hundred dollars is paid to a Peter. So how it is uh, entered in the accounts as cash debit two hundred, a Peter credit two hundred. Oh, then it's reversal. Reversal of entry. Yeah. Why? Because they switched. Not yeah. Switched. They've done the opposite double entry. So double entry. Okay. Yeah. So how you will? Uh, how you will uh, rectify this error? A Peter. Okay? This is his account. Yeah. There is a balance, carried forward balance, let's say uh, $1,200. So this amount has been paid to, one, uh, to Peter. Okay? A Peter, there is a balance outstanding 1200 so company has to settle okay so let's say the ba balance uh, brought forward this is balance brought forward no so here let's say this balance is 10,000 bank balance you had a bank balance of 10,000 and whereas your supplier balance is 1200 so you need to settle this so you paid 
1200 okay so when you make the payment you should credit back and you should debit the peter's account mm. is that correct okay so instead of crediting and debiting what you have done the accountant he debited here and he credited this account you understand mm. a peter and bank so what has happened no he has to pay 2400 mm. you understand so in fact he paid the full uh, we paid the full amount mm. so it will show now it is showing how much 2400 to be paid how do you rectify this how you will rectify this a peter you will debit uh, 1200 mm -hmm. and then bank you will credit 1200 mm. then okay finish okay let's say let's do this mm. so to rectify you said here credit 1200 mm. a peter okay a peter's account bank 1200 mm. okay so this is the error this will cancel down mm. okay this is correct now to this error this error is okay mm. but still this shows an outstanding balance then you do the same thing again again you have to do yeah. again you have to pass an entry mm. so what is the entry a peter 1200 1, Bank credit 1200, A Peter, bank 1200. So thereby this balance will become equal. Equal, zero. There is no outstanding balance. Okay? For compensating error, put, not compensating error. This, what, what is this? Errors of reversal. reversal. Okay? You need to do twice. Mm. The same transaction has to be repeated mm. in order to make this balance zero. Is that clear? Yeah. Okay. So that's it for today. So we will, uh, uh, with that, I uh, will conclude uh, today's session. Then uh, next time we will discuss about the errors affecting trial balance agreement. Okay. So that will be the next topic.